On Monday, September 26, 2022, Cyclone Ian was just a tropical storm blowing at around 73 miles per hour. On Wednesday, September 28, 2022, Ian stormed into Florida at speeds touching 140 miles an hour. From a tropical storm to a Category 4 hurricane in less than 48 hours. As Earth's climate warms up, storms are gaining strength and speed in as little as 24 hours, giving residents and state administrators little time to prepare. Why are hurricanes and tropical storms getting stronger and more intense? So to understand this, first we need to know where hurricanes get their strength from. There are three basic factors that determine hurricane formations. Warm waters of at least 80 degrees Fahrenheit, high levels of moisture in the air and finally converging winds. Over the years, the Earth's oceans and seas have warmed up to unprecedented levels all thanks to climate change. More than 90% of the surplus heat from human-caused global warming has been absorbed by the oceans over the past 50 years. On average, sea surface temperatures have risen by 0.14 degrees Fahrenheit per decade over the last century. That's crucial because storms gather strength over the ocean and the warmer the water, the more power they pick up. This makes the rate of intensification more rapid and allows hurricanes to reach higher levels of maximum sustained wind. The weakening of vertical wind shear because of the warming temperatures also contributes to the rapid intensification of hurricanes. The rapid intensification of hurricanes and other storms over recent years has made weather forecasting extremely challenging. It has also in turn affected the official's capacity for issuing warnings and taking various measures to control the damage to life and property. As climate change hits hard, the strength of hurricanes will increase rapidly along with the danger to the coast and to the lives of the people on it.